I don't actually like what the Sunday Times did to Mantu Shabalaram Simang, where they exposed the medical records on the front page. I don't think she's a particularly good health minister, but everyone deserves dignity, right? The only problem that I have with Mantu Shabalaram Simang is that she was the minister of health and she had poor health. <laughs> That's like seeing the minister of transport hitchhiking or something. <laughs> Oh, where's the Minister of Home Affairs? She got deported. <laughs> I mean, would you trust a dentist? No, no, you're in good hands. <laughs> You'll be fine. <laughs> but I wanted to replace the health minister, but I was taking too long, because she's sick all the time. I mean, she had a liver transplant, then she had a shoulder up. It seems they were replacing her. It was just one part at the time. <laughs> And also, people took this whole thing too seriously. You know, a lot of people, you know, the Minister of Health had poor health, and that'll cause negative investment in the country. <laughs> well, people overseas don't know anything about Mantu Shabalalam Simang. You could ask him, have you heard about Mantu Shabalalam Simang from South Africa? No, is it contagious? Uh, <laughs> I've heard of TB and malaria, but not Manto. Should I get a vaccine or something? I don't know.